I don't pay too much attention to what is in the manifesto concerning corruption because we are noted over the years as a people who don't mean what we write. And we do the things, we only write it just because we want to win elections. So I'm not surprised that you have so many promises and little emphasis on, on that. But what I expect is the things they say. I think they should talk more about corruption and how they will fight corruption. Uh, because the more they talk about it, the more that the public is conscientized as to what it is that they intend to do. The other thing that I think will be important is for them to demonstrate how they will deal with the corruption that will occur within their region. Because we are very good at dealing with corruption when we are not in power. And or when, uh, when, okay, when we are not in power and we are criticizing those in power. Or when we are in power and we are dealing with those outside power. But the corruption often occurs when we are in power. And that's very important that we hear more about how they will deal with that. Because it will occur whilst they are in power. Yeah, and, and it always occurs. It's not by any particular political party. Very often when you have sessions like this, you will see that those who are in charge normally don't attend. It is those who are concerned about it who come and talk and talk. And I don't know whether when they are far away, they laugh at us or not. But uh, it, somehow I'm sure they, they, they hear it would have been good if you have them and you are interacting with them. So 